Hey there, I'm gonna do my thought of the day here. And what it revolves around is uh, just the, the feeling I got tonight uh, while going into a grocery store and realizing how uh, we're all brought into each other's lives and, you know, for one reason or another. And and uh, so many times this happens with me in the in the teaching world and it's just so funny how it, it just couldn't be so random. And uh, tonight's story just makes me feel that way. So I, here's the deal. I walk in the grocery store. Here's this kid and his bicycle's broke down. He's got flipped upside down working on the chain and sprockets. And the teacher me wants to go over and be like, hey, do you need help? And I'm like, ah, oh, just let him do his thing, go and do my shopping. And I come out and I see he hasn't made any progress. He's in the same spot. So just like with motorcycles, you think, boy, boy, if I could help, you know, this would be nice. Maybe it's just something really simple. And I get over to him and he really looks upset. He looks, you know, almost almost in tears, you know, and, and I don't know how he old he is at this time or anything. Just look like a young fella. And, and uh, anyway, I ask him if he knows what he's doing. He says, no, you know, I, I think I can get it. And he goes, but he looks at me with these big, like, puppy eyes. And he says, do you know? And I said, yeah, I think I think I can figure it out. And anyway, he's got the wheel where all the wheel bearings, you know, the balls fell out of it. And I'm like, oh, shoot, you know, you have a little bit more of a problem than probably can be fixed in a couple minutes. And uh, so I get to talking to him saying, hey, do you, do you live close by or whatnot? And he's, it turns out he just lives, you know, six, eight blocks away or something. And I, I'm in my truck. I said, let's just throw it in there and, and get you home. Man, kid is just really polite, that which is cool, too. You don't see that a lot. And... Uh, Anyway, we get to talking, and he's like, yeah, I'm, I'm uh, just graduated high school, and I'm going to be going to WIT next year, and, and I said, oh, that's cool, you know, what are you going to take? And he says, uh, you know, I'm going to take police science, or he goes, but I'm really interested in that power sports program, <laughs> and I'm just like, get out of here, and uh, so I let him talk a little bit, and I said, well, it's your lucky day, I said, I'm, I'm that guy, that, I'm the guy that teaches the power sports program. And uh, one of the instructors, and he's like, what? No way. And so we start talking about my YouTube channel and talking about how he can learn now. And, and I, 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 you know, I, I, I don't need to tell the rest. It's just that thing of, you know, what are the chances that I go to that grocery store at that exact time that the kid gets a flat tire and accidentally dumps his wheel bearings out on the ground and, and that I stopped to talk because I really didn't want to. I was in a hurry and I, I just wanted to keep going. I wanted to get in and out. And uh, I don't know, I'm just grateful for those moments. So the moments where you stop and you, you help someone else out and you just think, man, there's just, I was being tugged. You know, my spirit was telling me, you know, talk to this person, you know, and uh, I, I, I want to be mindful of how great it is when people stop to help us and talk to us in those times that we're in need so man what a what an awesome night what a small world to think uh it'd be interesting to see you know i don't know uh we'll see if he uh he does come out and actually sign up for the program or or what that um what that looks like but cool story want to pass that on i hope you had a great day yourself uh make it a great evening and we'll talk to you soon bye